Hey guys, it's Hedgy, back with some more uh, Pokemon Emerald Randomizer. In the last episode, we met up with Mr. Briny. In this episode, we're actually going to Newford City. We're heading on, Anchor's Way, Pico, we're setting to Oh my darling. Oh my darling, oh my darling, oh my darling, Pico time. You were lost in snow, got you. Oh my darling, Clam time. I mean, Pico time. Whatever. I don't know. I'm talking a lot of crap tonight. That 106 is not really interesting. We don't give a flying frick about 106. 106 is not the best route in the world. What you got? Ahoy! We've hit landing duper. I suppose you're off to deliver that letter to Holy Mouse Steven. Uh, yeah, sure. All right. Yeah, now I'm gonna go ahead and explore Doofer Town just a little bit before I actually go in the gym. You want to go into this cave? In this cave. It's the granite cave, mind you. We'll talk to this guy. Hey, you! It gets awfully dark ahead. It'll be tough trying to explore. That guy who came by earlier, Stephen, I think it was. He knew how to use Flash, so he ought to be alright, but... Well, for us hikers, helping out those we meet, that we meet is our motto. Here you go, I'll pass this on to you. And he gives you HM5 Flash. Yes, Flash actually lights up dark caves, but in, in battle, it's not really that... It's not really that, uh... What's the word I'm looking for? Useful. Uh, it just lowers the accuracy of a Pokemon, so, yeah. Teach a hidden flash to a Pokemon and use it. It lights up even the inky darkness of caves. But to use it, you need the gym badge from Doofert's Pokemon Gym. Which is why we're actually going to the gym. First things first, gym time. Alright. Let's go inside the gym. And now on the gym leader number two, Brawling. There are six trainers in this gym. All are optional. There's one optional double battle. And they all carry around level 13 Pokemon. Uh, his gym is of the fighting type, and his Pokemon are level 16 through 19. If you have a flying type, you should be, you should be able to get past this gym easily. Psychic moves will work, but some of the trainers have a Metatite, which is flying, which is actually fighting psychic, so just better off using a fighting fly, flying type. And he rewards you with the Knuckle Badge, the ability to use Flash outside of battle, and TM8 bulk up. And we're in Duper Gym, ladies and gentlemen. Hi all. How's it been? Oh, hey, how's it going, Champion Bounce? No, Duper Gym Leader Brawly coming with Fighting Type Pokemon. Going against him, a normal type Pokemon is asking for trouble. Fighting Pokemon will lay a serious smackdown on normal Pokemon, so be careful. What's worse, the gym is as dark as the ocean floor, but it'll get brighter after defeating the trainers in your way. Hey, okay, go for it! That I will. That I will. Now, you want to go ahead and try to make your way out of the, um, thing, because you can't use Flash, so... Since you actually have to have this gym badge to do it. And my guess is, you only have to battle, like, one or two trainers along the way in order to actually... In order to actually get the brawly. Ah, I stand corrected. You don't have to fight any of them. <laughs> Sweet. Yeah. Anyway. Hi, y'all. I'm Brawly, Doofer's gym leader. I've been churned in the rough waves of these parts, and I've grown tough. In the pitch black cave. So you wanted to challenge me? Let me see what you're made of. And so begins the battle against Brawly, Gym Leader 2, especially fighting type Pokemon. He's gonna send out a Machop first to level 16. Alright, Audie. The reason I picked uh, Audie because she is a psychic flying type. So, she, has no, she should have no problem in the gym. Because flying type moves. They murder, even though that really didn't do much because they're more evenly leveled than, um, than, yeah, the usual. Let's speed this up a little bit, because I know what's going to happen. He's going to end up using a super potion or something like that. He's going to have see super potion. Super potion gets that man shot back to full health. And he's going to end up doing something like that. Knock Audi out. Ugh. Anyway, that's good. There's a reason I actually left a uh, hole there. But you'll see it in a minute. Anyway, Jeff is gonna go ahead. 
And peck it. Yes, I caught a Firo on the way here. No big deal. But yeah, Jeff ends up knocking out that, um, much up. Now he's got a level 17 Meta 16 Metatite. This, this Metatite is actually pretty much a breeze. Especially since it's using stuff like that. If it goes first, you have no problems. See? Because Focus Punch is a two-turn attack, but if you get hit on your first, during the first turn, you can't move. So, it's kind of like saying, yeah, I'm going to give up my turn. And, look at that. Flawless victory. <laughs> Alright, now see? Now he's gonna say his, um, his strongest Pokemon, level 19 Makuhita. This thing is a, is the pain. This makes up for the Meta-type, basically. Fortunately, Jeff is able to knock out a bunch of HP. It's just that vital throw is gonna be a nuisance. Also, fortunately, um, uh, Brawly used both the Super Potions, so I should be fine. Also, I think Bottle Throw never misses, so you gotta be careful. You gotta be really careful. Anyway, let me go ahead and bring out Masei. Masei can back clean up here. Alrighty. Let's see what we can do. Let's go ahead and use Water Gun. And... Oh, that's gotta suck. <laughs> that did not turn out as well as I thought it would. Okay, D-Pat, your turn. How am I suddenly feeling so bad against freaking his freaking um Brawly? Anyway, cut to win. All right, we get our 354 points and D-Pack Guru 18. Nice, and we defeated Brawly. Heck yeah! Whoa! Wow! You made a much bigger splash than I expected. You swamped me. Okay, you've got me. Take this gym badge. And with that, the lights turn completely on, and we receive the knuckle badge. Heck yeah! Dun, 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 dun. The knuckle badge makes all Pokemon up to level 30, even those you get in a trade obey without question. And you'll be able to use the HM move Flash outside of battle. And if you like, use his technical machine too. We get TMO8. Oh, so Brawly, fill us in. What's TMO8? That TMO8 contains bulk up. It's a move that raises both attack and defense stats. And we registered Gem Leader Brawly in the PokéNav, so we'll come back here later for a rematch, I suppose. Hopefully with a bigger, better team. <laughs> I can't believe my team got... My team just got flattened. But yeah. Now that the gym leader, now that the gym's lit up, nothing really you can do here. Whoa, it turned too bright in here. Your future is bright too. That was corny. But you know what? I don't care. Anyway, let's go ahead and be back to the Pokemon Center and get a full uh, heal going. <laughs> Alright, we don't care. We don't care about your, about your healing. Anyway, I left an empty slot in my Pokemon, in my Poke, um, come on, section, thingy, for this reason. I'm going in the Granite Cave, and we're going to catch ourselves something interesting that I've seen in the Granite Cave, and it's not a Magnemite. Even though Magnemite can learn, um, Flash, we really can't use it. I don't want to use it. I'm going to put, uh, D-Pat up front. So that way D-Pat's not, um, like, murdered out here. I know it's a pretty decent amount of electric. Beautifly, really? We're not going to catch a Beautifly. But we are going to catch an escape rope. That is how you do it. You got to do it right, because if you don't do it right, you're going to do it wrong. Now, if I can remember correctly, there's, yeah, it's a Metang in here. Metang's not what I'm looking for. If I remember correctly, there is a Pokemon I wanted. No comment. There's a freaking Waylord in here. 
and it knows rollout. I just wanted to fight that for the experience, really. That's not where I want to go. What? Where I want to get? What do I want to get? I right, get a random Pokeball. I'm trying to find a certain Pokemon here that I, I actually knew was here last recording. I just didn't actually couldn't actually catch it, and I had to scrap the last recording because of uh, visual problems. And I fixed the visual problem on my own because I'm so smart. This leads me back here. Uh, come on. It's in here somewhere. It's no, it's not a Metang. Alright, I'm getting tired of looking. Cause... Is this it? No, it is not a Metang. Go away. Alright. I can remember where I'm going. By the time I find it, it's not a soul rock either. Alright. Let's see. Is this it? Skip loom? Really? What about here? Not a freaking methane! Go away! Alright, let's go deeper down in the cave. Maybe it's in this, in this floor. I believe it's this floor. May it be in this floor, let's see. What's this? Uh, it's, it's, well, while I do want to catch a Polyrath later, I'm not going to do it right now. Because I already have two water types on my team. In Striker and Massey. And I don't really need a third one. Although I put Striker in the box temporarily in order to um, have this Pokemon that I'm about to catch. There's that rock I was looking for. Yeah, and that rock is an Everstone. Now the Everstone actually... Um... Allows your Pokemon to stay in its current form. It will not let your Pokemon evolve. So, it's kind of useful. Anyway, random primate. Not what I was looking for. Stop kicking me. Fine. I, I'll just use Cut on you, because you're in my way. Don't use Rage. That's why I missed. Now, stay dead. Dang it. You don't die. But you fainted. That's good enough for me. Alright. No, Bellsprout wasn't what I was looking for. <laughs> it's like, hey, it's my pre evolved form. Haha. -ha. Even that ladder may be what I'm looking for. No, it's not a Bellsprout. You know what? I may not find it in this uh, recording. Yeah, I'm not gonna find it. It's no big deal. I'll find it later. Ooh, a freaking Whalmer. I already have two water types. Why am I suddenly getting. Owned by water type Pokemon. Freaking Swalot. Swalot's a poison type. I don't want the Swalot. This is the way. So, Steven, oh, hi. My name is Steven. I sound like Mr. Stone. Uh, Mr. Pokenav guy. Anyway, I'm interested in rare stones, so I travel here and there. Oh, a letter for me? And we hand over the letter. Eh, not the major. It's a shopping list. Okay, thank you. I went through all this trouble to deliver that. I need to thank you. Let me see. I'll give you this TM. Contains my favorite move, Steel Wing. And there you go. He already went through what it was. TM 47 is just Steel Wing. Pokemon appear quite capable. If you keep training, you can even become champion in the Pokemon League one day. That's what I think. I know, since we've gotten to know each other, let's register to one another in our Pokemon. Bunch of dots. And we register Steven. Yeah, you'll see Steven a lot more during this LP. So, no need to worry. Now I've got to hurry along. And on that, we gotta hurry along too, because we got stuff to do. And I thought I was gonna. I thought I was going to need. Uh, now I'm gonna stay in there, and I'm gonna catch this Pokemon off screen. <sighs> anyway, make sure to like, comment, and sub if you like what you see. Make sure to, um. Make sure to also throw me a, uh fave or whatever or sub to the show to keep updated also make sure to like comment and sub to people in my box and in the description and we'll go through one more battle before i uh use my outro let's see can this be the pokemon i'm looking for can it huh huh maybe maybe not quite no oh well i guess i'll see y'all next episode till next time hedgy out